Becca here in the Gardens at Science Museum, Oklahoma. If you're looking for a project to get you outside and get your hands in the dirt, something you can do this time of year is to cut back and divide your native grasses. So we have an example here. This is our little blue stem. And first you'll just need to grab a shovel and dig your grass up out of the ground. So we did that already. And the next thing that you'll want to keep in mind when you're dividing your grasses is that you want to have more roots than shoots. So first, grab some pruners and cut back all of that extra grass up top so it looks more like this. You've cut most of it back. Then the next thing to keep in mind is that what you'll be dividing is uh, mainly this first couple inches here called the crown and you can just use a saw hand saw to then come on in and cut that grass right down the middle just like we did here so you can see there's that crown we just cut right through that fibrous root system and now we have two different grasses we can pop in the ground and grow again this is different than dividing something else that has a different root system like irises. These have rhizomes instead, and these are even easier if you want to divide them. You just kind of wiggle them apart from each other until they separate. And then you again have two separate plants that you can move wherever you like. Same thing, you want more roots than shoots, so you'll cut back those leaves so that you don't have too much going on there and those roots can take over and grow into new healthy plants.